what's going on welcome to the ash life i love being on this channel i actually have a video that's coming very very soon um talking about my nail update <laughs> um i just went to paris if you guys don't follow me on instagram at ash220 underscore you wouldn't know that i went to paris and i've been like away for like a week but it was really nice to be able to go and i hate how dark it is out here like you try to film in the light but it's still kind of dark and it's probably because of my hat too um, but I went to Paris and it was really nice so you can see the pictures and I will try to put together a vlog if you guys want to see that I was vlogging but it kind of got a little difficult towards the end of the trip But today I want to do like a really casual Trader Joe's haul So I went to Trader Joe's and Trader Joe's has been my new spot Like I love body care, skincare, things like that It's just my obsession and Trader Joe's is actually known to have really good dupes for higher end products and i'm gonna just show you guys what i got and you guys can let me know what you guys get from trader joe's and this is also instagram inspired as well so first things first i have so for the aesthetics you know here's my little trader joe's bag i love their bags i absolutely love it and i noticed that they gave me like almost like a christmas looking one or maybe i could be wrong i don't know it's like a holiday bag <laughs> almost so that was cool but I took everything out so that we're just not rummaging through the bags. And this is so annoying because it's so dark. I'm probably just going to have to keep adjusting the camera throughout the video anyways. So the first thing I got, which isn't from Trader Joe's. It's a Trader Joe's product, but I did not purchase it at Trader Joe's because Trader Joe's um, sold out. And they, this was a seasonal product. This is their Brazil Nut Body Butter. It has acai and grana extracts and it's like a delightful salted caramel and pistachio scent now this right here is actually a dupe for the brazilian and boom boom cream from sol de janeiro which actually retails for about 45 dollars so this right here was only like 5.99 in stores and it's supposedly like a really really good body butter uh, i'll probably review it more on my main channel living ash but i definitely think you guys should buy it resale um i paid probably 18 dollars free shipping i know it's so you know, it's just what it is. Resale price. I didn't know. So I vowed to myself I'm not going to be late to the game with Trader Joe's products anymore. So this is their body butter. You've got to check it out. It's it's like one of the most viral body butters out right now. And it's really affordable. Um, especially if you don't want to spend that pretty penny on that Sol de Janeiro Boom Boom Cream. Next thing. And this is also an Instagram inspired um, video. Because I follow a lot of people from Trader Joe's. like Well, like the Trader Joe's Instagram pages. So, um, yeah, I get inspo from that. Next thing, you guys, I have these. Now, I don't know. Oh, I put them back in the bag. So, these are also new that just came out. I love elotes. Like, I, I make them myself, actually. Like, I went to a restaurant, and I actually learned how to make them myself. The You know, the dip, and you put it on the corn, and it's amazing, the Mexican street corn, all that. So, they do have this now, and it's the everything and the elote Greek style yogurt dip. So, I just actually used some regular crackers that I had. Um, I don't have any, like, regular chips, so I just tried it out with these. And it was really good, and I noticed it was good because I kept eating it. And if I don't like something... Probably not going to keep on eating it. Um, I believe this one's open so I can show you guys kind of like what the inside looks like. I did notice that there's like actual little corn pieces in there. I don't know if you guys can really tell. But there is, you know, it's a everything elote. It's with corn, elote seasoning, and grated cheese. And I like that because I love elote. So, hey, <laughs> why not? So, I did get three of these. They're new. I try to get whatever is new like super fast before it sells out. So I only got three. And I believe they were like, I forgot. I don't have my receipt on me right now. But they were like five something or three, maybe. Something like that. So that was cool. I also picked up the chili lime mayonnaise. I don't know what I'm going to use this for. I'm going to probably look up recipes of what people are, you know, using with this. So I got the chili lime mayonnaise from Trader Joe's. I'm obsessed. I think Trader Joe's is so cool because they have so many things that you would normally not be able to get. You can't get them anywhere else because it's, it's a Trader Joe's product. Another thing, guys, I got this. This is actually, again, again, this is so Instagram inspired. Like, I find it fun to do this, like, to try things out and see what's trending. Um, this is the spicy mango lemonade. I saw this on Instagram and I was like, okay, spicy i can see mango lemonade that sounds really good and refreshing with spicy and you can kind of see like i don't know if maybe you see my fingerprints more so but 
um there's like little pieces like little spices in there you can see it spicy mango lemonade is 120 calories it's pretty big so i don't know I'm gonna keep it refrigerated as soon as after this is done. I had it in the fridge, I took it out for this video. And this right here, I had to share this. Okay, so on Instagram, this would inspire me to go to Trader Joe's today because baby, <laughs> when you talk about shower oils, I'm all for it, shower oils. Like I'm gonna go to the store and get a shower oil if I can. So they have the Trader Joe's Nourish Shower and Bath Cleansing Oil with Almond Oil. I believe these are going to be discontinued very soon. That's what I read on Instagram. So you're gonna wanna pick them up. They were normally like five something and now they're like $2.99. So I went crazy and I got a whole bunch. Um, one, because I love shower oils and I go through them super quickly. And two, um, I share them with my mom. So I picked up six of them and they were $2.99 so get them because if they're discontinued that's going to be hard and resale price they're probably going to be really expensive if you like a bath oil and that's going to be similar to the L'Occitane shower oil this is it it's a, supposedly a dupe I haven't even opened it and smelled it yet but it's very light like wow I can't actually wait to use it I'm excited and it, it almost looks like a cooking oil when i look at the back but it's luxuriously smooth and moisturizing with almond oil and it says lather massage onto skin during bath and shower and rinse. so uh, this is it the nourish shower and bath cleansing oil with almond oil very very good dupe for the lost insane shower oil it says on contact with water the trader joe's cleansing oil will turn into a sheer milky hydrating wash that cleanses the skin while helping it maintain moisture breathe into a scent of almond and it, it's an aromatic experience so i'm excited so i got six like i said and I'm excited so get it now because they're on sale and there may be you know they might be getting discontinued another thing I got this is the organic smoky barbecued flavor coconut aminos uh, I believe Tabitha I, I think this is kind of Tabitha Brown inspired because she did the um, carrot bacon and that went viral so this is the seasoning sauce so i believe this is going to give you that nice smoky barbecue um flavor that will give you you know like when you're going to put it on your vegetables or whatever so this is what it looks like up close we love to see it i had to get it instagram is so fun like oh, this doesn't help with my spending habits but it's just it's so much fun to try new things so also this this is a organic honey sauce and i don't know i go to this place called um it's not blaze pizza it's one of those pizza places and this actually it has um organic spicy it's it's actually organic spicy honey sauce with natural chili pepper flavor and you store it at room temperature and i'm gonna try it and see if it's any good um i didn't i don't know if i saw this on instagram or anything but um i just wanted to pick it up because i love honey um i like to drizzle it on my pizza like a nice honey sauce like a sweet chili kind of thing so we're gonna see how that goes also picked up these these are my favorite thing from trader joe's right now they're mac and cheese bites i used to go to cheesecake factory and love their like fried mac and cheese balls so to get these in trader joe's and they taste so freaking good and they're 190 calories for three pieces i actually just eat them as like a quick snack sometimes so this is what they are i put them in the little toaster oven and i'm ready to go i believe there's 10 pieces in each box perfect i love them trader joe's is a spot i also got this I, got, I saw this on instagram too this was the face and body sunscreen lotion i'm gonna try it out um i saw somebody use it it was like in a beach picture so i was like hmm i think i like that so i'm gonna get this well <laughs> i already got it and i'm gonna see how it works um i like sunscreen you should be using sunscreen on your face and your body the sun the rays all that protect your skin um so i'm gonna use this and i got this and i believe this was like five dollars too wasn't bad at all got me a all-in-one hemp peppermint pure castile bar soap which i'm super happy about because guess what I need Castile soap. I actually love it. And on my main channel, I'm going to talk about this. This wasn't a Trader Joe's find. This was actually Marshall's, but I thought it was a great buy. So I got this in Trader Joe's $2.79, I think. So that was good. And I think the last thing I have for you guys is this fruits and vegetable wash. Now, I normally would use like certain things like lime and like vinegar, things like that to wash off certain things. Um, it's a vegetable wash. So I don't, I don't know if people use this on their meats, um, but I'm going to try it out. 
it says apply a few drops directly to produce massage for 30 seconds so this is good for like my strawberries and things like that like rather than just using just purely water or whatever so i'm gonna try it out fruit and vegetable wash i haven't seen this anywhere else like a vegetable wash or maybe i haven't really looked very well that's pretty much it for the entire trader joe's haul i had a lot of fun in the store today like i i don't know i was on the phone when i was in there though but but like it's like almost therapeutic to me to like go in and get things that i see are trending and that's like super popular and just try them like why not and i love that trader joe's is like it's like a lot of like organic stuff and i was like really sleeping on trader joe's but i have good reason because there wasn't a trader joe's in my area there was only a trader joe's like in deerfield beach like really far away and don't mind if you guys can hear like some sweeping and stuff i'm in my kitchen so um, my parents are outside but anyways the best things that I picked up in conclusion um, today the most exciting things um, is this elote dip really excited about this this obviously wasn't a Trader Joe's pickup today but I had to get it so this is a highlight of my day it's from Trader Joe's so that's it and um, this right here the shower oils which I don't know if I showed up close so if you can get your hands on these, get them. Shower oils are really nice. They make your bath experience super nice. They just add to your experience. So go ahead and pick those up. That's pretty much it for this um, video right here. Subscribe to the channel if you are new. And if you guys want to see more Trader Joe's hauls and what's trending, I would love to do that for you guys. And it was just a simple video. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this. And let me know in the comments down below what else you'd like to see. Follow me on Instagram at ash220 underscore and livingash20 on TikTok. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.